How's it going folks? This is where you know, back with another lesson and one of my favourite songs from the 80s today, The Cult and She Sell Sanctuary. Uh, not really known to be playing on an acoustic guitar but it is great fun this one. Pretty easy to play as well, not difficult at all. Uh, I'm going to show you a couple of ways that you can play this so uh, without further ado, let's get to it. Okay so this song is in standard tuning and first of all I'll show you this little cool intro that you can do and this comes up at sort of various points in the song. Uh, you know in the little link part so we'll go over the intro part first uh, so I'll play so okay so all these notes are on one string which is the G string and we're going to start on 14 12 11 12 11 and then we're going to play 7 5 7 2 and we go back to 14 to 12 so then we go up to 16 14 12 14 and then we go up to 19 so put all that together we got Okay, it sounds really cool if you play that and play the open D string at the same time above it, so we get this. Okay, and then we kick in with the chords, and this is pretty much the same chords all the way through the song, so it'd be a D, D major. A C and a G. Okay, really cool to do the four fingered G for this one as well, which is, you know, like the rock G. So we've got the D major, C, G. Nice to do this little embellishment on the D, just taking the second finger off sometimes. I'll add a D sus4 in, adding a little pinky on the third fret on the top E string to get this. Okay, uh, then we've got this little link that comes after the first verse, here you go. So pretty much the same notes, just played in a different order, so we've got 14, 16, back to 14, 12, 11, 12, 12, so obviously add that open D string in as well. We go back into the verse and the sparkle in your eyes keeps me alive and the sparkle in your eyes keeps me alive keeps me alive and the world and the world turns around and the world and the world Okay, then we've got this link, which, so we've got the same notes, 14, 12, 11, 12, 11, 7, 7, 5, 
7, 11, 12, 7. So. Okay, so you can also play that phrase which I think is quite cool around the open chord so if we do a D chord we're just going to add the little pinky that will be on the 5th fret on the top E string slide it to the 3rd fret take it off regular D and then a, a quick on and off there with the D sus4 so we get this C G Okay, so I think it obviously an acoustic guitar, it sounds nice doing the open chords, the D, the C and the G. But you could also do it with power chords, which, uh, so we're doing a power chord up on first fingers on the 5th fret, that would be on the A string. Third finger is on the 7th fret on the D, little pinky is on the 7th fret, that would be on the G, so we get this. Move that down 2 frets, same shape. And then move it all up a string so we're now doing a G power chord so we got this and it's nice you, obviously if you do the power chords you can do the palm meeting that's putting that part of your palm just lightly resting that on the string so we got this So different ways that you can play, like I say, it's not really known to be playing on an acoustic guitar, but there you go. I prefer the open chords with it being acoustic. And the strumming pattern for that, which is just more or less straight strum, you know. So down, down, up, down, up, down, up. pretty much all you're gonna need okay so thanks very much for watching it with you all Douglas. Like, like I say a song not really known to be playing on an acoustic guitar but I think your songs like this are just great songs to play in there it's a lot easier than you think this song really really classic song one of the big iconic songs from the 80s so like I say hope you all dug that if you've got any other requests for anything you know 50s to modern day that's going to work well on an acoustic guitar within reason a lot of you know the drill now you can either comment in the post below or a good way to reach me these days is on social media. So I'm Wayne Argitore on Facebook, Twitter, and now also Instagram there. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you gave me a like or a follow on those platforms anyway. But that way, if you want to, you can send me a personal message requesting a song. I do always try and reply to messages. you just got to respect. I do get quite a lot, so I'd have to hemp at them a little bit. But please don't let that put you off. Please do keep your messages coming, because that's what keeps this channel going. Thanks everyone who subscribed, thanks for your very kind messages as always, really means a lot. If you are new to me, please do subscribe uh, and a further way you could help me out is hitting the little notification bell that's down there somewhere. Uh, another way, I always say word of mouth is a powerful thing, so please share my videos, please tell people about me, you know, if you know any beginners or people who've been playing for a while and would like some great songs to play, a little bit of uh, inspiration, you know, point them in my direction, I'd really appreciate that. So that just leaves me to say have a great morning, day, night, whenever it is you're watching, and I'll catch you all for a lesson very soon. Take care.